Hey guys, Seward so Mixer Video, and it's been a while since I made a new commentary video, but I mean, yeah, we're, uh, I guess we're sort of back with commentary videos, because of course we'll probably make some few commentary videos, but that's not uh, anything about the topic of this video. So, this video, of course, um, is going to explain to you guys about something that which I believe most of y'all probably forgot, but, um, most of y'all may be wondering, whenever you guys come to my channel, uh, what happened to Base Knight, um, you know, why is there not really anything much going on for Base Knight Omega Era Season 2, and I'm going ahead and, you know, talk about it. Um, so, the reason why you may have noticed in recent time that Base Knight Omega Era Season 2 has been recently inactive. It's because, um... It's because I've been recently been doing things, uh, not only in real life, but also have been working on Season 3. And I've actually been working on Season 3 since literally the beginning of Season 2. In which it's kind of interesting. But not only that, but the reason why, like, you know, I've been working on Season 3 that long and not been paying attention to Season 2 is because, really, you know, Season 3, to me, looks very, very, like, excited. While it just takes my inspiration away from eventually wanting to do anything for Season 2, uh, meanwhile. In other words, what I'm trying to say is that I kind of, like, you know... My motivation completely fell off for doing anything for season two. So you may have noticed that, like, yeah, there has been barely any updates, and as a result, I just sort of I look like I left um, doing anything for you know baseline or something like that. Although there has been some things that's been happening for you know the baseline battle rail OG map. And that's pretty much about it. In recent time, of course, I've been recently radio silent about um, bass as a whole. And it's just only because I've been working on season three and I just feel less motivated to work uh, to do things for season two. And also takes away my motivation of doing anything for you know streaming or something like that. Knowing that you guys have uh, most of y'all may have school, and as a result, I know that not many people will be online in the weekdays, so, of course, what's really the point of, like, you know, streaming other than in the weekends, especially the fact that Fortnite has been, it's just not really much of a good state. Uh, I'm just gonna be honest with you, and I'm really wanting to, like, you know, make another video about it. But it's not been very much in a good state. You know, this recent, this current season, though, you know, it is good. I think it's probably, like, you know, so far the best season of this chapter, and that says something. There's not really much of, like, you know, good seasons. All of them have just been pretty mid. Um, at best, pretty much. I just didn't really have anything much to say. Um, by the way, here's my cat. Um... So yeah, they've been pretty much, uh, it's been that much for Fortnite recently. In fact, I didn't even really feel like wanting to play Fortnite yesterday, and today I just only been wanting to play Fortnite for just a little bit, and I just end up, like, you know, feeling less motivated to even do anything on Fortnite, because it's just been very, very boring, and of course this current update. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna, like, talk too much about, um, Fortnite, but all I can say is that you know, this current season just feels a lot like, um, Chapter 2, Season 4, which was, which is one of my favorite seasons. Except there, there's just no soul to it. Um, the thing I mostly notice is that the people I re uh, recognize, they used to play this game, such as Fierce Way and, you know, Clips and all that. I have not been really seeing them playing Fortnite in recent times, so as a result, you know, it just feels like I'm literally the only person that's playing this game in the world. I'm the only person in the world that's just playing this game at this point. But there is- but Fortnite of course is not dead. It's not dead, it's just 
in my perspective, with the fr with my friend list and all that stuff, looks like it's dead, but it's not. But, but yeah, other than that, like, you know, for Season 2, the reason why I've been inactive is just because I just feel less motivated to do things on it, and I've been working on Season 3, and not only that, but I also have a feeling that you guys really just didn't really like this map. Um, I think I just probably overdid the map too much to the point where, um... Where, like, you know, there's too many volumes. At first it was a good idea, but I thought it could have been probably, like, something that I probably would do for later seasons. And that's why in Season 3, there can be speculations that there only would be one biome. And that may be sound a bit of a downgrade, but other than that, you know, that's what I've been working through, you know, in recent time. Not been doing anything for Season 2 been doing something for season three and season three of course as i'm recording this is 12 days from now and there's not really been much updates for season two but would i consider season two being a bad season no no i don't really consider it um season two had a very very great start but it just like you know kind of kind of got staled recently for me and that's just it so, that's just what I want to talk about in this commentary video. Um, I'm glad it's kind of a bit quick and I just like want to settle out real quick instead of like yapping too much. That's all I want to talk about. Um, so, so um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll catch you guys uh, later. See ya.